Hey, what is up, guys? Andy here with another YouTube video, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can turn your regular mic and make it sound a whole lot better without having any kinds of extra studio mic. You don't have to pop filter, none of that. You can make it sound so much better using a simple program called Audacity. Um, I did make a previous video um, a couple days ago, actually, with talking going over Voice Meter. It's another um, program which I have right here that uh, makes your voice sound even better than what you had before. Um, it's another program you can use, and you. I made a video for that. I will leave a link in the description below if you want to check that video out too. It uh, it helps your audio sound or your like your voice sound better as well. Um, so if you're interested in making really good audio quality video or videos or whatever, go ahead and check that video as well. But in this video, we're gonna be going over Audacity. Um, this is a really good program. It does work on Mac and PC, like um, Windows and all that stuff. And it is a uh, free program, which is a really good thing about it. So, you, and it has all these good features you can do with it. And a lot of YouTubers use this because they'll record their audio separately, and then they'll record their video, like their their video and their audio separately, and then they'll get the fi audio file from their Audacity, and they will um, combine it with their video, and have to work with it, and it makes it sound a lot better because um, it because you can alter your audio through this program, and you can't do that with your video and audio together. But anyways, um, so to go and get this video started, I will leave a link in the description below to download Audacity. I'll, it'll leave you, it'll go straight to the download, um, like the download link, so you guys don't have to look it up or anything. So uh, be sure to leave a thumbs up for that. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> but anyways, uh, once you've got it installed, it's a, it's a free program. Once, like I said earlier, um, once it's installed, it takes doesn't take very long to install, so you're good. Um, once it's installed, this will come up. There will be a uh, well, mine's on my desktop or on my uh, taskbar, whatever you call it, toolbar, whatever this is down here. Um, but it'll look like this little guy with headphones right here, or whatever. Not like a, I don't know what that little sound wave, whatever. Anyways, um, you open it up, and it'll come up to this thing right here. All right, so you want to have your microphone selected. I'm using a blue snowball. And your headset, I guess that doesn't really matter. I mean, I guess it does if you want to hear what your audio sounds like. So you want to hear that. Um, you can adjust your microphone, um, how loud your microphone and how loud you want your sound to come out through here. Alright, so, and then now we can go ahead and get started. So I'm going to go ahead and do a test here for um, this audio so you can see what the beginning and the end would be like. So let's go ahead and get started. This is a test using Audacity. Now let's replay that. This is a test using Audacity. Alright, so it sounds kind of like a, I don't know, like a stereo kind of thing. I don't know, sure. It doesn't sound as good as I'd like it to sound. So what I want to do is I want to select where I've been talking. So I guess I'll start from right here. This is where I started talking. I click effect and I want to go down to the effect talk bar will be right up here. You click effect, go down to equalization and you want to go ahead and click treble boost. This will bring up the highs and you click OK and it shot up a little bit right there. Then you click effect, you want to go to equalization again and you want to click on bass boost. Now if you're a girl, I don't know if you'd really want your bass boost or not, depending on how deep you really want your voice, but um, you can adjust this right here, you just slide this up or down, but I'm going to keep mine at 9 decibel, nine decibels, and close and click OK, and then it dropped our, brought our bass up a little bit, so now let's see what it sounds like now. This is a test using Audacity. See, it sounds a whole lot better than what it was before. This is a test so using control. Audacity. It is pretty loud. You can adjust the uh, how loud, like in your audio or in your video editing software, you'll be able to adjust the volume of your audio. Um, but another thing you can do here is, this is if you're still not sounding clear enough or loud enough, I'm not sure how it'll sound on this test, but um, click effect and you can go to normalize, normalize and click OK. And it makes This it is a little, test using Audacity. It makes it a little louder, depending on if your voice is still is not loud enough, but my voice seems loud enough, so I don't need the normalize. So I'm going to go ahead and undo that. So now I've got this right here. Now, if you're a person who's in a um, in a room and it has like a fan, or there's a refrigerator, or there's like your PC, your computer's making a really loud fan noise, it'll have these little um, right around here. See, I didn't have a bunch of noise, uh, like like right. It was just me breathing, I guess. But um, basically, okay. So if there's a long stretch where it's just noise, like a like it's a background noise, you'll have a it'll you can hear it. It'll be like a little echoing. What you want to do is you want to select it. So let's start from it. This is a test. This is a test using Audacity. Let's just slide this back here. This is a test using Audacity. Okay, so we want to start right here. You can hear it where I'm breathing. We'll just say there's a there's like a, this is a refrigerator sound. My breathing is a refrigerator sound. Okay. 
Um, what you want to do is you want to select that background noise, the place where you can hear the background of your fan or whatever. Select the area that you can hear it. Click Effect. Go to Noise Reduction. And it'll have blue right here. That means you want to click this first. Click Get Noise Profile. And what it does, it has selected that. Now you click Effect. Go to um, Noise Reduction. And go ahead and see it's not blue there anymore. You want to click OK again. And now it's shrunk that completely. See that it was there before? It's not there now. So now when we start the video. This is a test using Audacity. You didn't hear me breathing at the beginning like you did before. So it's really good if you want to cut out that background noise and it um so it like makes it where your voice is really prominent and there's no background noise, which I mean who wants background noise? No one wants to be no one wants to be able to hear the uh, person who's making their videos refrigerator. But um thanks for watching this video guys. This video helped you um, make your audio sound a lot better. Um, be sure to check out my other video, the voice meter video, because that is another good program that helps your audio sound better. Um, but uh, be sure to leave a thumbs up. This helped you, helped your, helped you guys out. Um, subscribe for more videos. I'm gonna be doing a lot of um, like screen videos, like through my computer, and gaming videos and stuff. Leave comments in the comment section below what kind of um, videos you be doing on my computer. I will be still doing um, like vlogs and noises and stuff every now and then. But I'm gonna like I'm still coming up with new noises and stuff, so it takes time. Um, but I will be making more videos very soon. So be sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. I'll catch you next video, guys. See ya.